Oh, hello. How's it going? Thanks for joining me. I'm just having a having a read and a coffee here at the Neptune Cafe. No questions. Um, not actually any coffee in this. No, there isn't. Oh well. That's a shame. <laughs> Good question. Who would it be? Um, I don't know. I, I would say Podge Brennan. Um, I think he's. I, I think he's hilarious. But I also think any opportunity to have a cup of tea in a wagon wheel is uh, is a good thing. When we talk romance with Sean, I really think anything's possible. Um, so who knows? Obviously, I'd, I'd like to tell you. Um, but I can't give anything away. Um, but at the same time, you know, we, we, we don't really know what happens. Uh, so we, we, we do wait for our scripts with complete anticipation, but there is always someone that, that Sean Holden has his eye on. And so no lady is safe. Single or taken, hat on or hat off. Uh, I'm, I'm currently single, so, um, so Valentine's Day last week was quite a lonely day, but actually very cheap as well, which is a good thing. And uh, hat off, hat always off, man. Hat always off. Um, yeah, we, we, I mean, I mean uh, yeah, TV3 were great like that. They got us um, a guy called Ian McLaughlin, who was an um, ex-detective. He's gone through all the ranks. And so he had some meetings with us and kind of, to get us into the mindset of what it's like to be a guard, and you go through your own research as well. Yeah, you. I mean, you you have to. You you can't pretend and, uh, unless you really know what what kind of job this is. Okay. And you, it is an answer. Am I a ladies' man? I shan't. No, I'm not. I'm not as much as the lady man as as Sean Holden is. No.